if um, I'm going to look at solving, trying to solve this problem, uh, first thing that I need to do is, I remember you got to look inside parentheses. See what's happening first inside your parentheses. And here what I notice is I have two sets of parentheses. I have two sets of parentheses. So you always want to work on the innermost parentheses first. So what I see here is I have inside this parenthesis, I have another set of parentheses. And therefore inside there I have 6 minus 1. So that's what I'm going to do first. So 6 minus 1 is going to leave me 5. Then the next thing it tells you to do is after parentheses, you want to work on exponents. So I need to just look and see if I do have any exponents. Well, first, I always need to continue inside my parentheses until until I don't need to use my parentheses anymore. So I look inside my parentheses, and I do, do I see any exponents? Yes, I see an exponent right here. So therefore, I'm going to do 5 squared. Um, so I have 5 plus 30 minus 5 squared is 25. And then now, if you guys notice, all I have is addition and subtraction first. I'm going to finish off the parentheses first, but then all I have is 5 plus 30 minus 25 is 5. Therefore, my final answer is going to be, I can simplify this down to 10. Okay? So that is how you use order of operations when you have two sets of parentheses. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.